Get away from that compiler. We're not done yet. We haven't covered everything we need for making a game. Even though we now know how to use graphics, sound, input, and text, we also need to regulate frames per second. Why? Have you ever popped in an old PC game, only to find that it runs way too fast? Sonic 3 and Knuckles for PC, and I think the original Duke Nukem do that for me. We need to regulate the FPS using a timer so that it won't run at different speeds on different grades of computers. Unless you just want to spite people with better PCs than you and make it harder for them to play because their game will run too fast. The Allegro code is pretty simple. This code is basically a modified version of the LoomSoft Tutorials timer function. First, create a volatile long name counter, and afterwards create a small function that increments the number. In main, after you initialize everything for Allegro, immediately use the lock variable function, the lock function function, and the install int x function. These will keep these updating at an even rate, which is based on the system clock. So now we'll add another while loop instead of the loop we already have. The first loop is checking if the game is done, like if the quit key has been pressed, and the second loop is to regulate frames per second. Now we'll have our input and update functions inside the while counter greater than zero loop, and our drawing stuff will be outside that loop, but inside the while game is not done loop. And at the end of the while counter greater than zero loop, decrement the counter by one. Alrighty. Next we're going to review enumerations and random numbers, which can both be really helpful when it comes to making games. Take care.